This time I'm not going to touch my keyboard. Or my mouse. Nothing will be touched. Pay attention, write this down. This is lore. Not touching anything. September 21st, 1987. It's been one year since I first went inside that house. I have to finish what I started. <laughs> what I am about to do has not been approved by the Vatican. Okay, that's what you missed. That wasn't really much. And I think that's gonna play again, by the way. Thank you, Spinner, for the four months. I didn't play attention. Can you play it again? No, just... No. It was very important. I think it's gonna... I... <laughs> One sec. Do I have to have this on the side, or can I have it black? There we go. Wide? I'm not gonna make it wide. No, that's gonna make it look like shit. Wait. Guys, no, this is gonna look bad. It's not, it's not that it just changes the resolution. It completely fucks up the art. I think I gotta turn it down more. Aberration causes a color effect on the screen? Wait, what does that mean? I'm not gonna play it wide. I miss wide shots, dude. You guys don't know what you're talking about. All right, I think I'm gonna do marathon mode, all three chapters in one session, just because I genuinely just don't remember much about. We'll test wide when we get in game. When I get in here and start walking around, we'll test it. And if it just if it just gives us more play area, that's one thing. But if it stretches it, I don't want to do it. <laughs> Guys, it just stretches it. You guys are fucking with me. Nobody wants it wide. You guys are just saying this because it's something stupid to say. You guys are so dumb. Have you forgotten already? This forest has a mind of its own. If you get lost, you could always try to remember where you've been. Pressing the escape key or start button is a good place to start. That was chapter one, guys. Uh, you know, lots of lore to unpack there. No, I just screwed up. I somehow died. I don't really, uh... Okay, this appears to be the map. Are you seeing this?
Would have been scarier if it was wide. No, it wouldn't. Look, guys, nature. That's beautiful. Dude. Okay. The deer unbothered by the death that just happened. Wait, I'm waiting for him. What? Waiting for him to yeet the PC out the window. I'm not a rage quitter, guys. Agent M, thank you. For the two months. Why does it say Morbius when you die? Shut up! Oh, you know what, guys? Yeah, I think I gotta pull out the- I think I gotta pull out the cross. I've been continually making the same mistake and not learning from my actions. Yeah, there's- there's the cross, sure enough. I'll be prepared this time. No, nope, just an animal. Just a stupid, stinking animal. Yeah, get gone, buddy. Get gone. Get out of here! Scram! A spirit. You're invited. Come celebrate Nate and Jason's sixth birthday. The creepiest clown I've ever seen in my life. Saturday, May 3rd, 12 p.m. to 4 p.m. Turn right at 1338 Snake Meadow Hill and go straight down past the well. Well, I'll be damned. Okay, guys, is it too loud still? Do I need to turn it down? A little loud? Oh, this must be where the birthday is. I'm tabbed out. I hope that it doesn't come running up. Okay. Let's go take a look. Damn it! <laughs> Lazy Romako, thank you for the 25 months. And Fiend Pixie for the first time prime. You do wide. I'm not doing wide. You guys are. Oh, look at this. Did he say cock? Did he just run up and say oh, cock? He said go cocks. <laughs> go cocks. Ah, an intellectual, a Cox fan. Whatever you were just about to say, I don't care. I think you said I have the body of something. Mr. Martin, it has taken longer than expected to register, re expected registering the markers on your property. As a historical cemetery, our office has had difficulty identifying who was buried there. The inscriptions on the gravestones are written in a language that we cannot identify. I've sent the gravestone rubbings to some of my peers at the University of Connecticut. I will reach out to you when I get a response from them. All the best. Daryl Henderson. We tried to make Thinly speak seeing this little guy running up guys reminded me we tried to make Thinly run like a uh you know that horse girl Whoa get out of here you know that horse girl who who runs like a horse she like gallops on all fours we tried to make Thinly do that and uh he said he tried it he actually filmed himself doing it but didn't like actually save it we got this dude on his hands and knees crawling down through the fucking hallway dude I wish he would have posted it. I would have showed it on stream and embarrassed him. 
Bob, the kids and I miss you more every day. The twins and Amy have started their next school year here at home. Amy keeps asking when she's going to be allowed to go to the real school. I think she's getting cabin fever. The twins are having no problems occupying their time. Yesterday they came in with their hands covered in blood. I guess they found a dead deer and they thought it would be a good idea to touch it. I think we might have a coyote problem because when I went out with them to look at the dead deer, it was a pretty gruesome sight. All this just a day after the twins' birthday party. Can't wait till you come home. Okay, gross. Wait, did you see that? Hey! <laughs> I think that was him. So much reading, I'm proud of you. Dude, I can read, it's just the fonts. Certain fonts are hard to read, like this one is hard to read. The Martin's house lies about a hundred yards off the Snake Meadow Hill Road. There's almost no driveway. Trees jut out of the middle of the gravel path that is mostly covered in grass. It was difficult to find the house, especially since it was already dark when we arrived. Father Allred seemed to know where he was going. He simply drove straight ahead until we arrived at the house. In the headlights, I saw an old shed off to the right of the path. Farther? Fa father? Father Allred explained that he would rather perform the exorcism away from the house, but the Martins had insisted that Amy remain inside. He complained that having the family present to make it difficult to proceed, or sorry, makes it difficult to proceed with the elements of the right that may seem harsh to the layperson. I'll be having that. <laughs> Guys, I don't, I don't listen. I was, I was not picking my nose, but I was scratching. And that guy came in right at. If he was like a second earlier, he would have caught me mid pick. I mean, scratch, mid scratch. And I would not have. I probably would have died. <laughs> I'm not a nose picker. Okay, I am. Everyone is. Okay, you can't- listen, shut up. There's certain things about human nature that is just universally true. Everyone picks their, their nose. Yeah, when I was four maybe? What do you do now? What do you mean? You just like sit there and let the boogies fall out? Mr. and Mrs. Martin greeted us at the front porch. Mr. Martin led us downstairs to the basement, explaining that Amy was down there in the restraints. I felt for him. There was a guilt and shame in his voice. Use tools? What do you- what- like a screwdriver? <laughs> Let me focus. Amy was in the very back of the attic in a chair, perfectly calm, staring at us. It is hard to describe the look on her face. It was not the kind of look a child gives you. Oh, this is freaky. Look, this must be her in the picture. Spirit was haunting the image. Sure enough. That must be Mr. and Mrs. Martin and Amy. Alright, we gotta stop with the nose picking, dude. I opened a can of worms I should not have opened. Oh, it's a cute, oh, it's a really cute drawing. Made by, uh... Someone. Adorable. <laughs> We've got ourselves quite the artist on our hands. Oh, look, guys, it's me. Cute. Let's go check upstairs.
You can change the text to be easier to read. Go to the option, go to the setting, make it wide. You were unbelievable, I'm not making it wide, dude. Demons. Demons enabled. Oops. Why do you want it wide so bad? I don't know if you guys actually want it wide or you're just screwing with me. I genuinely cannot tell if you guys are gaslighting me. I don't- why would- why would we want it like this? You guys are so dumb. I t <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whatever. It looks more scary. How does it look more scary like this? This is. Oh, it just stretched all the textures. <laughs> Oh my god, this is even harder to read now! You guys are so dumb! This is so hard to read! I don't feel safe in my own home anymore. I hear voices outside around the house at night. I don't let the twins go in the woods to play because... Guys, I have to turn my whole fucking head like I'm like, I'm like reading a billboard. I feel like I'm reading a billboard and I'm like two feet away from it. I don't let the kids go out in the woods to play because I'm afraid of what's out there. The house itself feels stressed, distorted, slanted somehow. It's like I'm walking through a carnival funhouse. Amy's condition has yeah. only gotten worse. I can't stand to be around her, and I don't know why she just doesn't seem like herself anymore. I want to take her to the doctor, but I can't leave the boys here. I find that the phone stops working throughout the day. And now I can't seem to find my car keys. Thank God Bob come home. <laughs> Thank God Bob comes home tomorrow. Pretty jumbles. Thank you, dude, for the four months. And random user for the 50 bits and Ash for the first time prime. For Wider? Yehao. Thanks for subscribing, partner. Yeah, this is great, guys. You can't even see where I'm at on the screen anymore. Didn't you used to have a wide mode hotkey? Yeah, I did, but that was on my previous OBS. Oh my god, guys, do you see what's on this shelf right here? Guys, look at that! Oh wait, you can't see because you want it fucking so wide that you... What is this? Bob must be stationed somewhere in the Middle East because he's sent over this weird-looking doll for Amy's birthday. I'll ask Anish about it next time we have book club. She looks like she could be from over there. Amy didn't seem excited to see the doll. I think she would rather have a phone instead. Or maybe seeing a baby doll makes her feel self-conscious about working at the clinic. First grade reader? You guys are so stupid, it's so... You... Oh my god, it's... 
I guess I was the only one who thought to check in the attic. When I got up there, it was freezing cold. I found Amy standing in the back, looking straight at me, like when I first met her downstairs. We spoke briefly, although it was frustrating to talk to her. Or it. I experienced a bit of deception from the demon. During our conversation, she uttered my mother's first name, and in other instances spoke perfect Latin. I called for help from the others, but nobody came. So I raised my crucifix and began the rite again. What the fuck am I looking at? Says <laughs> somebody who just got here. <laughs> See, guys, one second, it's coming back. Now it won't capture my game. You guys fucked this up. Where is it? Guys, it genuinely is gone now. Oh, there it is. Okay. We? Yes, you. <laughs> If you think you think you think a hundred people crowding around telling somebody to poop their pants and then when they finally go and do it, you think you guys aren't to blame? Oh my god, you guys know what this is? Red, blue, blue, green, red, yellow, yellow, green. Dude, I used to fucking go crazy on these things. I had a giant combo, I could get way up there. And Tenzan, thank you for the bits, dude. Thank you for respecting the artist's original vision. Yeah. And thank you, Teabag and Dragon, for the 13 months. <laughs> thank you, Taco Salesman, for the 100 bits. And Punish Venom Snake for the 16 months. And Drawn Natsuki, thank you for the first time sub. It's not a bop it? Who said it was a bop it? Guys, don't want to alarm anybody here, but there appears to be blood trail leading into this. All right, let's go check the basement. There's bound to be something down there. I don't know if the sound went off or if, uh, I don't know if you guys have bugged up the sound or if it's just quiet right now. All right, let's go down. Where did the funny crawling man go? <laughs> yes, you, you guys are involved. Uh-huh. Dear Amy, thanks for writing. It really brightened my day hearing from you. In your letter, you asked what the weirdest thing I've seen as a missionary. Ugh. The area we are working in has a lot of folks who practice Quimbamba. It's what you might call a pagan religion. It's kind of a mix of the Catholic and African religions. One of the saints they worship is San La Muerte, or Saint Death. Yesterday we talked to a boy about 15. When we asked him if he had ever prayed, he said, No, but I have prayed to San La Muerte. He told us about a time when he stayed over at his cousin's house, and according to him, they prayed to some figures of San La Muerte, and the figures made things in the house move around. He got real quiet and scared looking after that. Guys, I've you. 
I'm putting it back to normal mode. I can't read this. It's so hard. We told him he could pray to God and that God wouldn't make him feel scared like that. We invited him to the church, but he hasn't come yet. I need to wrap this letter up and get back to work. See you in four months. Signed, Layton. I don't have a first grade reading level. It's just... <laughs> grayscale or grayscale? Oh my god, this looks so much better. You guys are insane for wanting it the other way. You guys are like fucking with me. You're just fucking with me. <laughs> Smaller. No. Let me get immersed. For crying out loud. Uh-oh. Amy's parents could not endure witnessing the proceedings of the right for long. Miss Martin was hysterical, and the thing that was inside Amy was feeding off the fear. Father Allred asked me to take the Martins upstairs. I was physically worn out, but managed to get them back up the stairs into the kitchen. Amy was screaming, Mother! Mother! the whole time. Finally, I got them to sit down with me at the kitchen table. After a few minutes, we couldn't hear much of anything down in the basement. So I went down to check on things. I found Father Allred lying on his back, uncon unconcious, with his arms spread out wide. Amy was not in the chair. Oh, brother. Oh, demon shit. Back! I... Oh! Demon of the night, I urge you now, do not approach. I have the Lord on my side. Hear me, demon! Ah. Wait, what is this? We go again. Don't say Morbius, dude. Demon, show yourself. Here you are. All right, how do I pick which one of these is going to... I don't know what I even did. I'm gonna be honest with you, I just guessed. No idea. Snake stain. Thank you for the 1,500 bits, dude. Got paid, so here you go. Now bark like a dog. Uh, no. Not gonna bark like a dog. Um, thank you. Thank you for the bits, though. Do it? No, guys, I'm not gonna do that. That's so embarrassing. Thank you, Natsuki, for the 500 bits. A deal's a deal? What do you mean a deal's a deal? You can't just, you can't just give bits and say do something and that's, that doesn't, that's not binding in, in any way. I'm going to the damn basement. <laughs> You're just gonna waste his money? He wasted his money. Stop, I'm trying to, God, you guys are gonna get me killed. Let me focus. I almost died. I wasn't even paying attention. Okay, I was scratching my nose again. Also, simultaneously. It's not- that's not all on you. <laughs> okay, what do we- we got some sort of puzzle here. Some sort of demon shit going.
I think I gotta get out of this house. This place sucks. I'm not feeling it. The vibes are off in this one. Pack it up. Natsuki, thank you for 600 bits. Any requests? You want me to bark? You want me to purr like a little kitten? I'm playing. Not gonna happen. Oh shoot. Uh, uh, I better get up. Here. Hong Kongkin, thank you. Could you scratch your nose closer to the mic? No, you won't even be able to hear that. A letter! Molly, the church might contact you in a few days to tell you their version of what happened to me. I want you to hear it from me first. A year ago, I was involved in the exorcism of Amy Martin. From what they said in the papers about what happened, it isn't true. She, my, she, my superior father, with when I confronted her, she managed to cut the power to the house and her own parents with their own. I have to go back to that house. The nightmares I'm having are real. She's still there waiting for me. I can still help her. If I don't come back, know that I love you and I'm sorry. From John. Snakes. Sn okay, this is not- your username is not Snakes Taint. Your na- I was saying Snakes Taint. Your username is Snakes Taint. I thought your name was Snake Staint. Thank you for the 500 bits. <laughs> and thank you, Nick, for the 100 bits. And beautiful Jen, thank you for the four months, dude. I gotta solve this exorcism. Oh, brother. Father who, up, who, fa father who art in heaven, bless me this cross. Father up in heaven, give me this dub. Please, Father, grant me this dub. Let's go slay this demon. My God, what happened to you? Do you see my face is pretty? I have to finish what I started. She died, priest. Listen, demon! You will be banished! Leave this form! Leave this human's body! Die, you fucker! Lord, smack this demon down! Who is this? Lord, kill this one too! Lord, help! I Lord, you're gonna have to do a little bit more! Uh, this thing's follow- Oh, smokes. I don't wanna look, I'm gonna get scared. Oh, I looked! What, what? Uh, I think I have to like move. Mortis. Little update, guys. I think I have to. <laughs> I think I have to dodge. All right, get ready for the dodge. I'm gonna move down. Oh my god, no! Oh fuck! Oh! Yes, get owned. The Lord's got my back! You stupid demon. You'll regret the day that you fucked with me. I'm a servant of the Lord. Oh shit! Oh! It's hard to like line this shit up. These demons are wily. Fucking demon. Suck this crop. Mortis. Sc 
Sorry, guys. You're not gonna believe this. A fucking duck uh, flew in my window. Couldn't focus. I was talking the other day to uh, someone. I think, you know what? I think it was you guys. I feel like if a squirrel. <laughs> I feel like if a squirrel broke in to my home and with intent to kill me, it could absolutely do it. Squirrels are fucking weird, dude. It definitely could. Yeah, dude, because they'll just climb on you. You can't tell a squirrel to stop. It's gonna fuck you up. I mean, you might be able to grab it and, like, get a little... ...you know, damage done to it, sling it, throw it against the wall, but this thing is going to maim you. Like, you're not gonna leave without a fucked up... ...body. Oh, brother. What? It's one thing after another thing. What are you doing now? LORD! Ah! Ah, Lord! Don't, don't make me redo all that. Surely. The Lord's got my back here. The Lord gave me a soft checkpoint, really. There we go. Thank you, God. Thank you, God, who art up in heaven for giving me that checkpoint. God, she's... A little update. God up there, if you can hear me, she's doing some weird stuff. She's walking in... She's making a pentagon on the ground. Pentagon. Pentagon. Pentagram. God, it's a pentagram. Update, Lord. And it's not a pentagon! <laughs> I love the sound of this game, dude. Oh, you stupid game! I hate the sound of this game. I gotta just sprint away from her immediately. More. <laughs> Why did I walk into her? <laughs> More this. Redo. Okay, get. What is she? Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I don't. How do I get away from this first? Like, okay. Now I just chill for a minute. I think I just chill. Now she's doing some spell casting. It's all about learning her movements. Once, once, once she becomes predictable, then it's over. And you know what? I'm already starting to understand here. She's she's on borrowed time. I'm, I'm, I fear for my safety when I step on the pentagram. I'm gonna try to avoid doing that. Okay, I gotta- okay, wait, watch. Now she's gonna be at this left side. Watch. What are you doing? Uh, she's inviting friends and family over, dude. 1v1 me, you fucking idiot. Uh, that's got her. She's done. Watch. Stupid hitter, dude. Sorry, guys. I, I'm panicking, to be quite honest with you. I've beat this game before, guys, so don't be... Ooh, that was close! I think I might have found a safe spot. I don't think she can hit me here. Gonna go ahead and get out of the safe spot, though, just because... Jesus Christmas. You guys excited for Halloween?
More. Skill issue. Of course it's a fucking skill issue. What do you mean? I'm awful at video games. Was there ever a doubt that it was a skill issue? I just can't get close enough to her. Oh my god. I think the cl At certain times, I feel like I'm playing a Pokemon game. You know? Mama, 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 fuck! Yeah, I could not have met. Morty. Stop saying Morty. You mother stupid game, dude. Alright. There's a pattern that we can follow here. Why did that happen? I think it's because I'm touching the thing on the ground. Yeah, yeah there's a thing on the ground I keep touching. All I have to do is avoid that. Sometimes I get her and sometimes- Oh my god, please help! I really should have come here with like a freaking shotgun or something. Or a, like a cross gun. Oh, that's got her. Big damage! Oh, there we go. And just like that, the demon has been sl Hold up, folks. Hold the phone. Lord, she's still up. Dust that fucking gore off of my hands. But wait a minute. I think she still might be alive. I think she might have just jettisoned herself into the backyard. We gotta go out there and check. Dust the Cheetos off his hand. Guys, I think we're locked and loaded. One sec. A dog with one bullet. Oh. I tried to skip the t freaking dialogue and it made me shoot. What do I do? <laughs> What do I do? Okay, here we go. Thank God we have another gun with one bullet. A gun with one bullet. That could have been bad. Alright, now we just gotta wait to see the demon. And then we blast her. Let's go see if we can check the backyard. No, I think this lady's gonna be in the front yard. Do the mirror easter egg. You're saying I should go back to the mirror? I came into someone's house and is about to murder them. I don't think you understand. This is a demon. This is some demon shit. Where was that mirror at?
told to the judge, yeah, you know what, if I go to court and say, you t Your Honor, you don't understand the, the- You don't understand, Your Honor, it was a demon shit. I don't think that's gonna hold up very well. Yeah, now the- now the ghost is gone, it's no longer following me. Wait, you know what? I'm gonna- shh, yeah. I want to go inside the mirror. Watch this. Oh. Oh. Who? A gun with one bullet. You know, why would they just not give me a gun with, like, lots of bullets? <laughs> um... <laughs> Why? They could have just given me a gun with three bullets, and that probably would have been fine. A gun with one bullet. Three sixty. Oh! <laughs> what have we got here? This guy looks like one of those mushrooms. Die, mushroom. He looks like a mole. A star-nosed mole. God, I wish I had that gun with one bullet. Ah! We gotta see the death animation? Alright, let's see the death animation real quick. There was no- you're so stupid! You made me just do- you just made me do that for no reason! Oh my god. I cannot- I gotta stop listening to chat, dude. It's never been... It's never been productive. <laughs> Do the clock glitch? What is the clock glitch? A gun with one bullet. <laughs> to do the clock glitch, you must go up to it and go to the menu and set it to wide. Whoa, that's a whoa, that's a really cool idea. A gun with one bullet. <laughs> that's a really that's a cool glitch. I didn't know that was our right, watch. We're gonna make this hand work for it. Check it. I'm fine. Sometimes he teleports away to somewhere mysterious. Like this, where is he? Who, who can say? Oh, you so got on, you so bad. So bad. GG. Father who art up in heaven, thank you for this blessing. Thank you for this dub. October 23rd, 1986. Dear Dr. McGlashan, it has been 30 days since the beginning of my treatment here at Yale Psychiatric Institute. Dr. Spinnell, who has been so patient with me, has helped me understand my afflictions and has helped me find a way to move forward and accept the truth. With Dr. Spinnell's help, I have come to accept what really happened in September at the Martin family residence. I accept that what happened was not... the result of any supernatural phenomenon, but rather the desperate actions of a young girl driven to violence by her dogmatic parents and old church rituals that are thought to drive out evil. 
I'm happy to report that since accepting the truth, my nightmares have ceased and I now enjoy peace of mind that I have not felt since the incident. Given my progress since first coming here, I respectfully, requ I respectfully request release from Yale Psychiatric Institute. Uh, blah, 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 where did I leave off? Contingent upon following. Oh, wait, contingent upon follow-up appointments with Dr. Spinnell in the future. Sincerely, John Ward. Oh, I lied. I lied to him. Wait, I'm, I'm John Ward, right? Yeah, dude, I, I didn't think for a... S I'm just giving them what they want. Alright, let's go kill a deer. Or we could alternatively kill that little crawling guy when he comes out. You know that little creepy pasta? Dude, by the way, I gotta say, big cigarette. Look, it looks like a giant cigarette. God, what I wouldn't give to smoke a baseball bat-sized cigarette. Look how good that looks. <laughs> Guys, I want to take a Marlboro sponsorship. Tinitoy, thank you, dude, for the two months, and Lunchbox for the 200 bits. Thank you, dude. Stopping vaping has never been easier. Just start smoking. Oh, I didn't even have to use my gun with one bullet. Easy. I will say of the Lord, he is my refuge <laughs> and my fortress. <laughs> my God, in him I will trust. I shall not be afraid of the terror in the night. Robaz, what's up, dude? Will that get in darkness. Thank you for the raid. Because rage. I have made the Lord my refuge. Because I have set my love upon him. Therefore will he deliver me. I shall call upon him and he will answer me. He will be with me in trouble. He will deliver me and honor me. <laughs> All right. I can't explain what happened at that house. I can only have faith that I did the right thing. Faith Chapter 1 I'm glad I'm re- I'm glad I'm replaying it. Ending 5 of 5. Is that a good ending? I feel like this is absolutely a good ending. Well, I, I, I exercised the demon. I said the one-liner. I shot the little frog guy or whatever. This is the true ending? Damn, dude. Police animal experts investigate chupacabra remains found near Sterling. Sterling Police Department is enlisting the help of local animal experts from the University of Connecticut after the remains of an unidentified animal were found near the Sterling. Near Sterling. <laughs> the remains the remains of an animal, which some residents are calling a chupacabra, were discovered on Snake Meadow Hill Road by motorists yesterday. The animal has disappeared. Wait there. <laughs> the animal has apparently been struck by a vehicle, and parts of its carcass were scattered across the road. Police said they initially investigated the gruesome scene because of the motorist who discovered the remains and had told them they appeared out of... They appeared to be of a person. Ew. After arriving at the scene, police concluded that the remains were some kind of animal. As a matter of public safety, ab I can't read, guys. I can't fucking read. As a matter of public safety, we want to be sure about exactly what we're dealing with here, said a Sterling police spokesman. This is clearly not a deer or a coyote. It is, if it's a mountain lion or exotic pet that escaped from its owners or an animal with rabies, we need to know about it. 
Animal experts attached to the investigation would not speculate about what kind of animal had been found. Although they commented that the animal was hairless, anemic, and apparently suffered from the rickets, a vitamin D deficiency that appears in animals and children who have not received enough sunlight. Oh no! Guys, was that animal like a, like one of the kids who lived in the house? Maybe, guys, no, maybe, you know what, maybe it was a chupacabra. <sighs> Look at my... Father Garcia, you are hereby instructed to release Michael Davies from your custody and return him to his home immediately. Mr. and Mrs. Davies have already been contacted by our office. A representative of the church is currently en route to their home to discuss compensation and return for their discretion. You will meet our representative there and accompany him back to Rome. From Cardinal Gifford? Can you play Reader Rabbit next? I swear to God, if Reader Rabbit is like a first grader reading game. Oh, thank God, guys. It's not a first grader reading game. Thank the Lord. It is a second grader reading game. Dumb. Oh look, my cross has faded a little bit. I got the copper cross. <laughs> oh, you think it's just wood? Yeah, this might just be wood, to be honest with you. Oh. You know what's wrong with this kid? He started playing uh, League of Legends. <laughs> yep. It's all, it's the exact, it's a pretty, pretty, uh, pretty bad case of it. Germa? This is the kid I killed. Okay, dude, what? How are we doing today, my dude? you get better, my I need to make you better. <laughs> Ew, this is freaky, dude. I don't want to get near this demon, kid. One sec, let me go refer to my notes. Let's see what stage we're dealing- Oh, I can't go back upstairs. Uh, I can't stall. All right. Lord, grant me strength. I'm going to attempt... I'm going to attempt to perform the exorcism on young Michael here. Michael, how do you feel? Do you feel better yet? Lord, calling upon your strength once more. We're going to zap him a little bit harder. <sighs> Michael, how are you feeling? Looks like I need to pull out the 360 degree range of motion. <laughs> My connection with the Lord is gone. I don't feel his power here.
<laughs> Michael? Michael? You need to go back down and strap yourself onto the bed again. You shouldn't be, uh, running free like this. Michael! Put that person's body out of your mouth! <laughs> Michael! Don't make me hit you with the cross, Michael! Michael! I like Michael's little voice, it's kind of cute. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> you see me do the shuffle out of there, dude? What the fuck? <laughs> the run! Oh my god, the run! <laughs> Oh my god, it looked like I was sidestepping. <laughs> oh, where am I? Is this Faith Chapter 2 now? Have you forgotten already? The notes people leave behind seem to exist on the edges of memory. Pressing escape key or the start button is a good way to remember what you don't realize you have forgotten. Oh, my notes. Who was that? Ironic Prince, thank you for the bits, dude. And the nice message, thank you. All right. Another day, another exorcist. Woo! Okay, just animals. Just animals. Nothing freaky. <laughs> Blah! This is like a Hank Hill. I think we're going in the... I, yeah, I think I gotta mix it up. <laughs> Jesus be ballin', you're lost, idiot. The Lord would not call me an idiot. Oh, well, looks like they've started decorating for Christmas a little early. Aha. Uh -huh. Thank God I'm in the presence of the Lord. Notice the crosses? I'm safe here. Hmm? Doing a preliminary check to make sure none of these gravestones are haunted. You never know out here. Oh, there we go. Look what I what did I tell you. Look at this. Good. I shook hands with the devil. I looked him in the eye. He looked like a long lost friend. All right, just some emo shit. Yeah, I like the music here. Monsterella, thank you for the four months, dude. Thank you, dude. Yeah, I, I need to shut that down, the Patreon. I feel bad still taking money from that when I don't provide people anything. It makes me feel like shit. I appreciate it, though, dude. Dearest disciple, verily, not everyone who says Lucifer, Lucifer, shall inherit his kingdom. You must first conjure his demon. You must then serve his demon. You must then walk among the children of men as his demon. Thus shall you receive the blessing of the unspeakable. Return to the saved family tomb whenever you are in need of rest. From Gary.
Thank you, Dofa. I appreciate it. Save? Oh, whoa, whoa, you're right. Evening. <laughs> Evening, folks. Just gonna save up here. How are we feeling? Okay. Not much has changed, I don't think. Thanks for service, Craving Partner. Case face. Thank you. F. Why are you saying F? Wait, are you say- oh my- you guys are so stupid! Because of the key? You guys- you scared the shit out of me, dude. I thought my stream went down. Wait, let me go back and look at this. Can I do this again? <laughs> you guys scared the shit out of me. That's a good joke, by the way. That was a good joke. One sec, I'll... I'm changing something real quick. Joke incoming? No, I was just- I'm, I'm, I'm changing the widget settings. I'm banning the letter F. No, I'm not. I was just changing the widget settings. <laughs> yeah, say F now, see if it comes up. Wait, it wouldn't. It wouldn't. <laughs> I don't know. Whatever. How did someone just post a backwards F? What the fuck is wrong with you? What is that? Someone just said, Sign of the Demon. Stop, you're freaking me out. Okay. Wait, these guys are telling me which way to go. Look at this. Right. Up. Left. Up. Right. Up. Left. And last but not least, up. Okay, I just... <laughs> Frozen chest hair, thank you for the first time, Prime, dude. And thank you, Hey, I'm Steely, for the first time sub, and Iconic Prince for the bits. I appreciate it. Wait, uh, I didn't go... Oh my god, you're right. You're right, you're right. Right up, left up. Sorry guys, I'm stupid. Right? Wait, 
Which way was it? Right, what? Right, up, left, up? I just saw somebody post a pentagram. ASCII pentagram. How did you do that? Dude, there's so much- Whoa, whoa, whoa! They summoned him! They did this! Be gone, demon. I'm a servant of the Lord. And he'll suck the sin out of you. Ah, ah. I'm fine. <laughs> huh. These demons bleed. Oh, it is different locations. I think. Guys, this is not working. This isn't working. Right up, left, up, up. This isn't working. <laughs> Make it thinner. I'm not gonna... Oh, wait, 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 wait! One of the dudes is gone. This is good news. I missed a note. Let me go drop back and find it. Right? Up. Left. Up, up. Can you turn down the music? Is it too loud, chat? Too... too wide. Shush. <laughs> oh, the game's too wide, guys? Sorry about that. I'm fixing it. Wait, it's still screwed up. Wait, what did I do? How do I keep messing stuff up? I try to do these jokes, but then I mess it up even worse. I, how is it like this? I did center on screen, and it did this. Transform. Center on screen. What did I do? Keep it. No, this is awful. One minute. Wait, what did I just turn on? Wait. Like a chroma key. No, this- I'm getting distracted. Focus on the task at hand. Reset transform. Why is it what? I- I'm just clicking reset transform and it's doing all this stuff. Transform. Reset. Okay, there we go. Whew, sorry guys. Yeah, I think- I think demons might have been at play there. I think there might have been some evil entity on my PC. On my personal machine. 
It is with great sadness that the, Ster the Sterling community announced the passing of Cindy Marie Martin, 38, and Robert Kimball Martin, 40, devoted husband and wife and beloved parents. Their lives tragically came to an end on September 21st due to an accident at their home. Bob was in training. Bob was a training advisor for the United States Navy and Cindy was a CPA and more recently a stay-at-home mother. They were married March 12th, 1969 in Voluntown, though oh, that was a period there, sorry folks. Though not particularly religious, they taught their children to be kind, generous, and involved in the community. Guys, this is a, this is a gravestone. You can't say nice. A public closed casket memorial will be held at Tillinghast Funeral Home at 10 a.m. Thursday. Burial services will proceed shortly after. Bob and Cindy are survived by their daughter Amy and their twin boys, Nate and Jason. Your name is Nathan and your cat is named Jason? Dude, I had to be the one to tell you, but I think you might be, uh... I think you might be dying. Look, a little skull! Wait a moment. I think this cross has changed orientation. It was faced to the west, and now it's to the east. Huh. Alright, we're out of here. Let's get the fucking. Whoa, what is it? It's like a gecko. Be gone, gecko. Back to the zoo with you. Penis demon? This time he dies. Come here, you fucking idiot. Oh, you. He's really trying to get me with his weird little penis. Easy. Yeah, it does. It looks like a little gecko or a frog. Nobody was thrilled when I got pregnant. Not even a little happy. Even my doctor seemed to be judging me. Each time I'd leave the doctor's office, I'd see this strange woman across the street. All she'd do is stare at me and just smile. No words. Just a big, warm smile. Somehow it made those visits a little more bearable. After I lost the baby, I saw her again across the street from the doctor's. Her smile was as big as ever, but somehow not as warm and friendly as I remember. Yesterday, I was walking and was shocked to see the woman standing in the middle of the path. Now she was pregnant. She beckoned towards me. I followed her off the path into the woods. That's when I met Gary. Wait, is Gary me? Or is Gary... What's my guy's name? Someone said Gary's Mod origin story. Shut up. That wasn't f that wasn't funny. I'm John, okay. We're learning about Gary. What a pointless gate! Goodbye! Oh wait, you know what? I should probably try to interact with it. It's locked. 
Oh no, what will I do? Anyway... I don't think I should be going here yet. I think I missed something. I guess, I don't know, I kind of worry about straying too far. I feel like I'm gonna get lost. Save first, I already did, I think. Okay, that just is an endless loop. It's locked. <laughs> Stop, I know, I know. Hey, can you help me? Whatever. There was that little cutscene. There was that little cutscene where I held the key up and you guys said F. I just worry about straying too far, because what happens if I go way too far out and then I just end up getting lost and then I can't find this place again? Why does he keep not exploring? Ugh! You're right, okay, you're right. Listen, chat, this is my problem. I just think about too many- there's like- I just think about like all the possible options and I'm like, oh, I could go this way or I could go this way or- And then I end up doing nothing. All right, you're right. I'm just gonna start walking. What's the worst that could happen? Okay, I'm back. It's locked. It's oh, okay, it's still locked. Look, there's a little I'm gonna get you to look at this. I'm gonna try to take a screenshot. There's a little bit of a something right when I click this. Right when I click it and the window pops up, there's a second window. Watch. It's locked. What did it say? That might have just been the window. I don't know. Right. Up. Left. This is pointless. It's locked. <laughs> right, up, left, up, up. Wait, I haven't gone down. Holy smokes, it's a little demon baby! Lord, forgive me for the- for, Lord, forgive me for the skull I'm about to crush on this demon, baby. It's so small and cute. Time to send it to hell. Where are you, you demon baby? It seems to favor the fog. There you are. No problem, I'll just do it again. You got owned by an infant? Okay, shut up. Oh my. I shouldn't stand here. Morgan. Shut up! The 
baby acts unpredictably. That's the thing about babies. They don't have... Listen, I'm, I'm approaching this from an angle of, like, what a human would do, what a, what a real human would do, but this is a baby. Babies aren't humans. They're just weird little things. They can't think yet. They behave so unpredictably. I hope he doesn't- There you go! Back to hell with you, demon spawn. Who was that? Max Grip, thank you for the 500 bits, dude. I appreciate it. Losing Grandpa was the hardest thing I ever experienced. We were really close. I cried about it for weeks. Then my stepmom introduced me to some of her friends. They asked me, Would you like to see your grandfather again? I missed him so much. I was willing to try anything. That night, my stepmom drove me to one of her friends' house. They took me down to the basement. I saw my grandfather in there. Only it wasn't actually him. When I tried to run, they closed the basement door and locked me in. I can't remember much else from that night. My stepmom's friends are always coming by the house now. They tell me I have a debt to pay. They say they have work for me to do. <laughs> Growing my grandpa reference? Yeah, sure, maybe. Um, guys, the heads are gone. Someone just said that's okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for reassuring me. Don't mean to alarm anybody, uh, anybody, but there's a my, the my my reflection is at the mirror and I'm not up there. Notice I said mirror this time because people make fun of me because I say mirror. I'm gonna go say hello. Wait, I have an idea. Guys, you might think me insane, but watch this. <laughs> Dude, we need a we need a go cox emote. And now if I get lost, I can just follow my bloody blood trail back. Look, here was my idea. I saw this at the start and I was like, man, it would be really cool to have like a pentagram form in this. And I was like, but how am I going to draw it? Oh my god, my fucking controller started vibrating. Oh my god, my controller was on my desk and it started vibrating, dude. That scared me so bad. I thought the demon was like... I don't know, about to choke me out. Oh my god, that's scary. Could you guys hear that over the... Could you hear that over the mic? What is this? What are you? Get out of here! Man, that scared me. Big cheese, thank you for the bits, dude. 
a new first person update for wrestling empire wait what there's a first person mode i'll check that out for sure why are you saying quote unquote controller what does that mean They're joking that it's a vibrator? Why would I, okay, why, why would, a, if I had a vibrator on my desk, why would it just start vibrating out of nowhere? <laughs> yes, I have a vibrator, it's how I cheat at chess. Notes, the new patient, the new patient initial consultation. Subject, John Thomas Ward, present. Dr. James Spinnell, PhD, and two orderlies. Subject, non-responsive for first half hour, followed by fragment, fragmented exorcism narrative. Subject, unable to maintain cons consistency in story. For example, stating that Amy was in the basement and then saying she was in the attic. Subject, insists incident was the result of a demonic possession. Cannot declare subject of sound mind. Will require several more sessions to fully understand subject's mental state. Will advise Martin family attorneys. Dude, by the way, more games need to just like register that you're using a keyboard and mouse, but then just have the controller randomly vibrate in a jump scare like two hours into the game. That scared the shit out of me. Like, you guys don't understand. It was a controller sitting to my right. Like, and there's nothing over there but just dark, scary, like, who knows what. Oh, that scared me. Oh god, I'm bleeding again. Let's open this gate. Um, was that just a big freaky tree? Treeman, someone said Treeman. Holy smokes. A, a treant? One sec. Spot the difference. This is like a nice spy book. One of these trees is not like the other, and when I walk by it, it's going to scream at me. But I can't tell which one's which. There's got to be one pixel off. You know what? They wouldn't do it so soon like that. They're just going to they're going to hit me with it later. She guards the door to underground purgatory. I hath not seen her. Children fear her. Day one of our paranormal investigation into the old Snake Meadow Hill Church, we've got three cameras, a box of tapes, and enough beer and beef jerky to last us a week. On our way in, we asked some of the, the locals about the church. It was mostly the stories we had heard before. Evil spirits dragging children into the cornfield and secret tunnels under the chapel. But there was a spindly lady game that we hadn't heard yet. Apparently it has to do with summoning the spirit of a woman who... ...used to take care of the orphans back in the 50s. There was even an old rhyme they used to told us. They told us... Walk the church from room to room, and maybe you will see her. She will move when you do, but never try to trick her. Awesome. We're going to try the game tonight, as soon as we get settled in. Um, wait, so wait. She will move when you do, but never try to trick her. Okay, I can do that.
Wait, the candles are trying to tell me something. It's so stupid, guys. I've played this game before. I've played Faith 2 before. I just remember nothing about it. Watch the candles. That's what I'm saying! So, you tried to trick her, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, that might have been my bad, guys. I think I tried to trick her. Let me re refer to the riddle. Walk through the church from room to room, and maybe you will see her. She will move when you do, but never try to trick her. Yeah, it must have been a trick I tried to pull. Also, look at the candles. She's above me. She's... She's... The candle represents her. I think... Dude, this is a... Never mind. <laughs> Say it? I was gonna make, like, a penis joke. But not only did I not have a penis joke <laughs> in mind, I also just, like, realized it was probably just a terrible idea to even do that. <laughs> Night three. Shouldn't have come here. Tape's missing. Lars stuck behind the basement door. Henry hasn't come back yet. Can't leave anyway. Someone said, can we get this voice for us? Dude, that would be terrifying. No, I don't want to get that voice for you. That is the scariest thought I've ever heard. No, I'm not going to let you guys talk like that. That would be too scary. I don't even know how I would re recreate that. The controller, thank you for the first time Prime, dude. Here, say hi. Say hi. Hi! <laughs> how, okay, so how would I even, like, maybe some gain? Hi! Say Mortis. Mortis! No, that did no. Wait, what about this pitch? I bet I could pitch shift it. Mortis! Mortis! <laughs> this doesn't sound right at all. Go Cox! Go Cox! Mortis! Go Cox! What about this? Wait, what is this going to sound like? Say, say, Mortis. Run, run! Ow! Don't ax! Mortis! <laughs> no, guys, I... I, run, I, run. I, I don't know how... What? Mortis! Mortis! <laughs> this is going to be a pitch shift. Here we go. 
super pitch. Rock. Furry. I'm not a furry. Shut up. Furry. Wait, it's not doing anything now. Nice Wait, well, now we might be on this. We're kind of like in the right direction, maybe. Maybe, maybe now distort it a little bit. Hey. Morris. <laughs> Morris. I have no idea. The actual voice is called Sam. Sam Software Automatic Mouth. I wonder if I can get. I wonder if I can talk to Games and I can get that implemented. <laughs> yeah, that sounds just like it, guys. <laughs> what what would what would I change to make it sound even more? <laughs> this doesn't sound right at all. This does not sound I my wife. Let's see. Pitch. What is schwa? S C H W A? I have an option for Gaussian noise generator. What is that? Let's try this. Ow! Ah, okay, no, no, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. Yeah, let's never do that again. All right, we're gonna we're gonna turn all those off and get back into it. That was loud. <laughs> oh, it's Mother Mary. I'm sorry, guys. That could work if you turn down the intensity. I don't want to. I'll test that off stream. I don't want to risk deafening all my viewers right now. Egos and fish. Thank you for the first time, Prime, dude. Get back. Let's figure out what we were doing. <laughs> Who is that? Best at losing. Thank you. For the first time Prime as well. She's the top right torch. So I can't enter the same room as her. Wait, where is she? Guys, there's only one torch. I think she might be in the room with me now. Yeah, she was up there. Holy smoke a moly. I'm getting out of here. Wait, there appears to be a room here. Taco Salesman, thank you for the six months. Mona Lisa Skull Room? Wait, how did I get to that Mona Lisa Skull Room? Okay, I'm here. This scandal is me. 
Aha! Night one. We still haven't found a way into the basement, but we found something just as cool. A secret passage in the old confession booth leading to this hallway. Henry's going to town to buy a crowbar. We'll see if we can't get these boards off some of these doors. But that's not even the best part. We caught an EVP. You can't hear it on tape very well, but to use it kind Wait, to us it kind of sounded like a laugh. Thank God we brought the nice mic. We'll review it on the sound gear once we get back into town. <laughs> Guys, my grandpa used to make me go ghost hunting with him, and it scared me so bad as a kid. He would go out into the cemeteries at night. I know I've talked about this, but I'm going to tell you again just because why not. He would take us into the cemetery at night, and he would just... Yes, for real. He would turn the fucking windows down. He would roll the windows down. And he would just make me sit there and hold this, like, little microphone, this shitty little microphone he had. Oh, she's here with me now! Oh, she's here with me now! What do I do? Okay. Anyway. He would, uh... He would go and, and then we'd go back, and if that wasn't bad enough, dude, I would already be scared shitless the entire time. And then we would go and we would sit in his living room and he would make me scrub the footage with him and sit there and listen to this shit. And he would be like, did you hear this? Wait, 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 take it back, take it back. And he would turn it up and it would be like. Just like ambient noise. I didn't hear anything. But then he would like, I feel like he would put it on his computer and like boost it up or something. And there was one time he played this uh, audio snippet. And it petrified me with fear because it's... Guys? <sighs> it sounded like somebody saying, Who's there? Or, Who's dead? That's what he said. Those were his two leading theories. Who's there or who's dead? And needless to say... Needless to say... As a, as a small child, that fucked me up. I was petrified. Yeah, what's this eye? The ghost called me a poop head. <laughs> Maybe. Possibly. Either way, it scared the freaking Jesus out of me, dude. All right, there appears- Oh my god, the ghost is here with me, wait. Pulled a cross out in the room she's in? I'm scared to do that, dude, to be honest with you. For a scary TTS try, a whisper? Yeah, I've done that before. We've used the whisper one, I like it. Oh, that's the- that's the dude from the first one. Remember? Okay, let's read this. Night two. We're gonna be rich. We've caught supernatural stuff on camera. Chat, by the way, when I face reveal, I'm going on a ghost hunt. And we're, we're you, I'm taking you guys on a ghost hunt with me. I don't believe in ghosts at all, but I'm going to get like, I'm going to pretend to really believe in ghosts and we're going to go on a ghost hunt. Night two. We're going to be rich. We've caught supernatural stuff on camera before, sure. Doors opening on their own, things falling off of shelves, but nothing like this. Tonight, while we were trying to... Sp while we were trying the spindly lady game again, one of the candles on the floor lit up by itself. As soon as Lars walked into the room, it was nuts, and we got it all on film. We're gonna make a fortune selling this to the TV stations. Just face reveal right now, don't even think about it. The reason I'm not doing that is because I have some obligations coming up, but after my obligations and I can just stream back to back for like a month straight, That's what I'm waiting on. The court date. <laughs> the court date. 
Yeah, I've got the court date coming up. <laughs> Let's see, who was it? Control Squid, thank you for the first time sub, dude. And thank you, Von Binja, for the four months. And Sushi Gummy for the ten months. And Matt, thank you for the 333, dude. Is it going to be a dream kind of face reveal? Yeah, I'm just waiting for my first suit to come back from the cleaners, and then we are golden. Alright, I've got her cornered. I'm going to try to get in here and ch hit her with the cross. Wait, what? She should be here. Wait, was that a statue always there? And the crosses are hung back up. Wait, no, she's below me. Now she's above me. Now she's below me. Now she's above me. What is... Okay, this lady's stupid. She's here with me. She's here with me now. What's her name? Chat, what was her name? It's like Betsy? What was her name? Betsy? Or Maria? Stephanie? Oh, 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 Stephanie! Freeze! Oh. You can't tell the ghost to freeze. They're not going to listen to you. <laughs> Ghosts only speak Latin? I don't know any Latin. Okay. Dude, I inhaled and, and yelled again. I did like... <laughs> She's here. Keep the cross out. Don't let her get to you. Don't let her get to you. What's my character's name? Lance? What is his name? There, she, she was trying to sneak up on my ass. How do you... John, okay. I'm John. Just dodge. Okay, you're right. Wait, she's in here. Demon! Are you here? Spindly lady, I've heard tale that you've been terrorizing people in these churches. Spindly lady, might I introduce you to the power of Christ? Where is this lady? Are you over here? She's in the room with me. There she is. Alright, dodge. Drive-by. Give her a drive-by exorcism. That was a good hit. She's gonna mix it up and go like on two instead of three at some point. Watch. Never the mind, forget I even said that. Easiest peasy of my life. And you know what? I'll be having the night two note. Her last words were carrot cake. <laughs> <laughs> All 
All right, let's get to the basement. Mouse cursor cameo. <laughs> All right, down we go. This is my final memoir. Hastily scribbled on a page of the good book, I now descend the staircase, knowing full well that she waits for me ahead. Checking my old watch has revealed something quite astonishing. Time doesn't change down here as we know it on the surface. Even now, the hands don't move past 2 a.m. God's work be done. I have been to where only the faintest lights shine and protect me from things unspeakable. God help me, Father Clark, a foolish old man, going mad in this dark prison, ears bleeding from the screams of the demon. Lord, do you hear me? All's quiet on the Lord's end. Some sort of ritual? Okay, we're going to need to rememberize this. Lord, provide me with the, the knowledge of remembering. Thank you, Lord. How am I, wait, what, how am I going to possibly remember this? <laughs> how am I going to remember this, actually? What if... What do they want from me here? What? Oh, Jesus. Thanks for what? Subscribing partner. You guys happen to see that on the right-hand side? Something? I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't want to go over there. I don't know what it is that is. Oh, 2 a.m. You're right. 1, 2. We got to get to the H. H right here. Oh, I think I beat it. Oh, shit. Uh. Did you flip it off with your cross? Hush, let me focus. I'm trying to decipher it. Let me look at my notes again. Let me refer to my notes. I don't need help. Time doesn't change down here as we know it on the surface. Yada yada, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, this is making sense. Um. This is act this is good. Let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait, one, two, three. This is definitely a, a clock. This is a clock. Trial and error, you think? I thought it was a puzzle, but I guess, yeah. I guess we'll just trial and error. See, what's really stressing me out is the fact that I'm going to have to go here. I'll try this. Surely this won't... Alright. Clockwise from two. Well, uh, that doesn't make sense. I've already tried the H. Nothing happens. <clears throat> Wait, what's the 12? Let's do the 12. That would be the one that looks like a vampire upside down. 
That'd be this one. I don't know. I don't know what it's trying to tell me to do. <laughs> the H first? I've done that. Nothing happens. Like, look, wait. Nothing happens when I step on this one. Oh, jeez, brother! Oh, jeez, brother! Easy. Step on things in the order that nothing happens. Oh, that's a good idea. That's a good idea. Okay. Oh, oh. Have faith. Oh! Yeah, how? Thanks for subscribing, partner. I there was no way I could have made it all the way over there. I just gave up. Just brute forcing it? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what the puzzle could be here. Wait, so maybe, wait, let me see. HXF, wait, that's like the phase logo. HX phase logo clock hands. <clears throat> HX phase logo, oh, spiral. Oh my God, okay. Uh, Lord grant me the power of remembering. <clears throat> It's all becoming clear. I'm starting to remember, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. H. X. Phase logo. Clock hands. Spiral. What was that, Lord? What was the next part? Oh, yeah. What's up? Uh... Yeah, I think it was the plus and a check mark and then the house and then the clock hands again. Plus the check mark, house, the clock hands. Yeah, this is all making sense. Lord, what was the next one? Oh yeah, it was yeah. It was this one? Thank you, God. Passing through, guys. I came out the porta potty. See, this is when they get you with that tree thing. Now the tree's gonna come back alive and scream at me. Bah! Nothing to worry about, just some deer. Wactacular, thank you for the four months. <laughs> just a couple of weird dogs. Three murdered in latest wave of ritualistic killings, Sterling, Connecticut. The bodies of three young people were discovered in the woods outside of Sterling last night in what authorities are calling a ritualistic murder. Sandra Atwood, Angel... Angel Noggles... Oh... And Troy Inglis are the names of the unfortunate victims who were apparently stabbed multiple times and beheaded before being killed. Before being killed? They were beheaded before being killed? In a paganistic ritual. Pandemonium. Re, re, pandemonium Regnat. 
Two of the victim's bodies were also partially burned, although authorities would not specify who. The bodies were found several miles from Gallup Cemetery, where residents reported a tomb had been desecrated. They also found trails of blood leading off into the woods. Investigators would not comment on whether or not these two incidents could be re re related. <laughs> The arrangement of the bodies and the ritualistic pattern, as well as the writing of certain symbols in blood, matches the style of several murders that have occurred in the Sterling area since 1986. The killings may have connect may be connected to the last week's brutal s <clears throat> Sorry about that, folks. That snuck up on me. Uh... Last week's brutal slaying of Amy Martin, a 17-year-old girl by John Ward. Ward had impersonated a priest to gain Amy's trust before luring her into the woods and killing her. That's not what happened! That's not what happened! I'm John Ward. That's not what happened. Investigators are asking residents to report any suspicious activity to the police. Authorities are urging the people of Sterling not to mourn the loss of our Atwood. Uh... Nogales and Inglis, because after all, they were degenerate devil-worshipping thugs who were hooked on crack cocaine and hated their parents. <laughs> Why even conduct an investigation at all? That's what you would like them to think, wouldn't you, John? They were just... They were just three pathetic outcasts who got what they deserved. You actually did the community a favor. When you found them getting high in that tomb, you stalked them through the graves and killed them one by one. You ignored their cries for help, their pleas for mercy. You put holes in their ruined drug addict bodies and then you chopped off their heads because everybody knows that removing the head is the only way to kill a snake. Well, guess what? You didn't kill the snake, John. You can only kill what you cannot be killed. And then it goes on from there. of cute somebody said chicken what how does this resemble a chicken at all what do you mean dude i'm cute as hell i am cute as hell <laughs> yo, 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 yo. hey Hey, up there! Why is there an arrow pointing down? Do you see that? On the right? Oh. Oh, we got a hill. One sec. No. No going from here. We're going back up. Why is everybody talking about my mouse all of a sudden? <laughs> Put your mouse cursor over Charworks. Yeah, you guys want to hold hands? Line your mouse up. We'll be virtually holding hands together. Well, look at that. If it isn't candy tunnels, let's go take a look. That's the mark of the beast. Satanism. 
My mouse is my mouse cursor is bigger than yours. Is something happening? Guys, it's not capturing. Wait, my, wait, something funny. I did something very funny, but it's not capturing. How funny? I'm talking like really funny. I don't know why you guys can't see it. I'm, I'm, describe it, I made my... <laughs> I'm just gonna take a picture. <laughs> it's not displaying for some reason, but... I wish this was displaying, dude. It's not showing for some reason. Like, I'm, it's massive, but it's not showing. I don't know what to tell you. Like, it's so big, dude. <laughs> How do I get this to capture? This is like really, f this is like some good tech. Wait. This is like good tech for a joke, but it just for whatever reason doesn't display capture. Yeah, I don't know, guys. Alright, I'm gonna make my mouse cursor back small again. <laughs> Man, that was that would have been such a funny joke. Why is it smaller? I don't know. It's like so big I can't even like do it. Well, now I don't know what the original size was. Oh, one. I guess it was one. Alright, we're back. Who was that? Cun Brecken, thank you for the five months, dude. Put a soda can next to it for reference? No, this isn't that funny. God, I wish I could, like, show you how big it was, though. It was so big. Alright, whatever. I'm burning daylight here. Someone's running through the vents! Hey! 
<laughs> gong, 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 gong. I bang on it with my big Jesus cross. Yeah, this is chapter two. Read. Wait a second, guys. Wait a second. When C... When C... Don't... When you see it, don't move. What could that be talking about? Don't move! Don't move! I moved. I don't know why I did that. I don't know what was going through my head, guys. I just moved. <laughs> That's cool that you guys can type that like that. That looks cool. Alright, don't move. Not moving. Not moving at all. Hands off the keyboard. Whew. That was a close one. Alright, we're good. <laughs> Wait, look, the blood trail goes this way. That looks like a gate to hell, but what do I know? When I was a boy, my nana used to tell me old legends about the dragons, trolls, and demons that lived up in the mountains of Norway. In those old tales, the people were never strong enough to kill the monsters, so instead they would sacrifice one of their own to appease it, keep it satiated, satisfied. It was like a deal with the devil. One sacrifice per year so that the beast would not come down from the mountains and slaughter the entire village in one night. There was no candy store eat killer. Wait, there was no candy store killer. What we're dealing with is not even human. When I got separated from the other officers, I saw the damn thing dragging what was left of Jenkins down into the lair. That's when I understood. The bums and the tweakers, the ones with grid, and the child prostitute runaways, they'll eventually come back to the tunnels. They always do. I c it can have them. For all I care, nobody wants them around except maybe that thing. And I tell you what, I hope to God it never gets tired of them. They're feeding people to the to the beasts. When are you gonna play Overwatch 2? Tonight after I end the stream, that's when. Why did I walk all the way down here? There's no way there's anything down here. Oh! This is as far as I'll go to hide my stash. Nobody goes past the first pipe. Nobody except for those strange people with their bodies painted red and their eyes like animals. Twice a month they come and pass right through into the deeper tunnels. Sometimes I can hear them yelling or chanting. Sometimes I hear something like an old woman laughing. Sometimes I hear things that aren't even human. Whatever they are, they sound really, really big. As an Overwatch 2 player, don't play Overwatch 2. Ah! No! 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 Stop! Please! Why did he- why- okay, whatever, I don't care about him. <laughs> you guys have this shit copy and pasted. <laughs> An EpiPen? <laughs> you 
Yeah, that guy was so sweet, he knew that I was low on my, uh, blood sugar. He knew my blood sugar was getting kind of low. Or high, whichever one requires a, an EpiPen. Or a, wait. Am I thinking of the right thing? Whatever. Stale Flakes, thank you, dude. For the three months. Whoa, guys, look, some sort of fossil. Two more dead discovered outside Candy Tunnel near Sterling. Two more bodies have been recovered from the drainage ditch under Snake Meadow Hill Road outside Sterling. The notorious Candy Tunnel, known in the area to be home to an addicts, gangs, and runaways. And the... <clears throat> Sorry, folks. Uh, and the in indignant has been the site of several grisly discoveries over the past three months. Since May, five bodies have been recovered from the drainage ditch leading to the tunnels. Authorities are being pressured by the... God, it's so hard to read this font. Authorities are being pressured by the concerned citizens to search the tunnels amid fears of a possible connection to Joe Bauman, a.k.a. the candy store killer, who has claimed eight victims in Connecticut and Rhode Island over the past year. Hello, brother. Let's hope I don't run into that dude. Maybe that was that guy who just stabbed me a second ago. Another body. Multiple officers wounded, one dead in the sewer tunnel shootout. Law enforcement officials are reporting multiple officers down, including one deputy who was fatally wounded after an exchange of gunfire in the sewer tunnels near Snake Meadow Hill Road, also known as the Candy Tunnel. Witnesses says they heard that the shots approximately 10 minutes after the police raided the tunnels where suspected murderer Joe Bauman, aka the Candy Store Killer, was alleged to be hiding. At this time, it is not known how many officers have been wounded. Although it has been confirmed that one officer has been killed, officials are not saying if Bauman was wounded in the exchange and efforts are being made to recover the casualties from the tunnels. Yeah, the president was down here? Kinda nuts. I feel like I'm walking in circles. Am I? Wait, am I walking in circles? I am! What is going on? I'm. No, I gotta get out of here. Maybe if you keep going in circles. Shut up! <laughs> Alright, I'm going back in here. I feel like I... I don't know, I feel like I'm missing something. I need to get in there, but how? I need to get to the blood pit. And see, I could go left again, but that dude was down there who was ready to kill me, so I don't really... No, the blood trail... Wait, there's arrows up one of the grates. Oh, you're right, you're right, you're right. Oh my god, you're right. Look at that, I didn't even see that. This is how we win. There we go, dude. Okay. Now it should be smooth sailing. Nothing bad ever happens in the sewer tunnels. Huh. 
Hello? Oh, better pull my cross out. I don't want anybody to run up on me. Without the Lord at my side. Ah! 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 Okay, I screwed up. I'm gonna go down for a minute. The mouse cursor? No, this is... A, listen, if, if you weren't here earlier, just put your mouse cursor over mine. We'll all hold hands. That way it won't be so quite so scary. I'm sorry, God. Please save me. I'm gonna follow the blood trail. Guys, you're gonna have to stop making fun of my tiny cursor. I'm, I'm self-conscious about it. Little demons. Some little children down here. Hey! What? The kid just ran into his mouth, I think. Whatever. Okay, he's back. Where are you, you bastard? What are you made of? What did you say? I'm gonna- I'm just gonna leave. No, I can't- OH MY GOD HE'S RIGHT HERE! Hard. What do you want from me, dude? Who is it? Ironic Prince, thank you for the bits, dude. And the nice message, thank you, dude. I appreciate it. Is this your first time playing? I played Faith 2 when it originally came out, but that was a long time ago. I don't remember anything about it. This guy's screwed up. He, lo he looks like he might have got all his skin peeled off. If he wasn't so hostile, I could take him to the hospital. But Lord knows he doesn't want to play fair here. He's gonna keep running at me trying to bite me. It's okay though, it's all in good fun. When I banish you to hell for the rest of eternity, we'll see who's laughing. Oh! There's gotta be like an easy way to see which way he's gonna be. Ha ha! Did he say goodbye forever? That was kind of sad. I actually. Uh... <laughs> Fucking naked guy sprinting through the. Okay, whatever. Alright, so is this the guy that I... that I run from? There's one guy I don't move when I encounter. Yeah, we're definitely in demon territory. This... Oh yeah, that's Latin. Or something. Oh, what have I found? It's locked. They hate the light. Back, back you. 
Dude, they got kids running around down here. These kids should leave. This is not a pleasant place. This is freaky. Back. Ouch! Dinka, thank you, dude. For the 28 months. Much appreciated. This dub goes out to you. I wanted to, like, kind of see down here. Aha! Who was that? I'm Riles, thank you for the first time sub. Huh. Okay, so we've got a little st statue or a... Why do I hear something? Anyway, like I was saying, we've got a dancing baby statue, and we've got a statue of the uh, little monster that I was earlier. I don't think I'm going to be getting there anytime soon, because I don't know what the hell it wants. Wait, actually, let me put my cross out up here. Nothing. <laughs> Cringe-ass Nene baby? What's up, Krusey? Thank you for the bits. And thank you, Midnight Iridescent, for the two months. Appreciate it. I'm gonna go try to figure out where this key goes. Aha. Aha ha, we're making. Pardon? The power of Christ compels you! It's another priest! I'm pogging, I'm pogging! Religious pog! Alright, I'll protect you while you recite the Lord's Prayer. Come on. Asterail, thank you for the 19 months, dude. Alright, get to reciting. I'm gonna protect you, get to reciting. Yes, it's true what happened to Amy. You are no murderer, God. There is no but you do have God. Thank you, Garcia. I'm glad Garcia's got my back. You're the only sane person around here, Garcia. Who is this? Oh god, you better not be freaky. Damn it! It's freaky! Back off! <laughs> Recite a little bit quicker, Garcia! Quicker, Garcia! Quicker, please! I don't got my... I can't do this forever! Be gone! Little Pichu, thank you for the 300 bits, dude! It's hard because you can't go, you can't, you can't... Oh, that's a not ideal spot, Father Garcia. That's a really going to be a hard spot to protect. Maybe not. 
<laughs> you see him poke his head out and he's like... Oh, I was, scr okay, I was scratching my nose again. I'm not gonna lie to you. I get itchy. What do you want from me, dude? And I swear to God, I wasn't picking. I'm a I'm a big religious man in this game. I would not swear to God on any other. Ah! <gasps> Let me focus, dude. By the way, straight up ignoring chat for now. What? What now? Oh god, they cut the lights! They cut the power! I hope Garcia didn't get got. Sounds like a goddamn dial-up connection. Garcia, look out! Huh. You know what she sounds like? Oh, no! You fucker! You know what she sounds like is this. Wait, I can't do it. Your Father Garcia, he's probably okay. He's probably fine. Father Garcia, take my hand. Oh, wait, one minute. This is for Father Garcia. Was he supposed to die? I... Maybe he's still alive, to be honest? I don't know. I think I see him breathing. Oh yeah, that hurts, doesn't it? Oh god. Oh. Just a dream, just a dream, guys. John, I can't do this anymore. I'm sorry. I will always love you back, Molly. And we got a cross up. Good to see we praise the Lord in this household. <laughs> she took the kids. Honey! John, it is not too late. Your soul can still be saved. All is not lost. Please wait for my next letter. For now, I have many questions that need answering. In the meantime, be careful. They are watching for you. Signed, Father Garcia. Wait, I, but that I was... Survived, but did I really do the right thing? 
I don't know what is real anymore. My face is weak, and I feel a dark shadow over me. If I can save the boys, maybe I will find what I'm looking for. So wait, what? Was that just a dream? Oh god, he's following me with his fucking Humvee! Ending 2, Road to Redemption. Alright. Now we start Faith Chapter 3. September 21st, 1986. Dude, this is- I'm so excited. Father Garcia! I don't need to tell you that this assignment is top secret. Yes, sir. Wait, why is I can't hear? We could be in for a very long night. Is this your first exorcism? Yes, sir. God, this this is gonna own. We're gonna get in there and we're gonna kick this demon's ass. Oh, I know what house this is, but this was the first one. No, I think this is a flashback. What was her name? Amy! Are you back there? We're priests! By the way... Amy? Amy, can you hear me? I'm a priest, I'm a man of God. <gasps> Hallucination? Flashback? Can't be sure. Yeah, this is a flashback to my first exorcism, which was Faith One. Faith One was going back to that place. Amy, can Those are fighting words. You can tell she doesn't like that. Okay, I'm having nightmares back to the, those, back to those times, those days. October twenty eighth, three days until the profane Sabbath. Gotta turn that down again. Alright, I think it still might be too loud. What do you think? I mean, the music- no, don't get me wrong, I'm not saying it's bad. I'm just saying it's loud. Ah, what do we got? John, we don't have much time. The profane Sabbath is almost upon us. 
If they find Nate and Jason, they will perform a ritual on them to call forth a demon of unspeakable power. The name of the demon is Malfas. I am in the process of discovering their whereabouts. I will contact you again soon. We must not let them do to the boys what they did to Amy. Father Garcia. Alright, let's go fucking slay some demons. I'm not going in there. <laughs> Put another cross on the wall. So wait, what, what is in here? Is there a demon in here? I'm not going in there. What happened in this room? Something bad. <laughs> That's the cross collection room. John, I can't find Nate or Jason Martin in the state in the state foster care system. It's possible that after what happened last year, they went to live with their relatives. I will try to find out what I can. Meanwhile, go investigate the clinic where Amy worked. We must find the place where they intend to summon Malfoss and disrupt their plans. Yes, father. Have you forgotten already? Things are never quite as they seem. If you can't discover truth from lies, you could try remembering what you know to be true. Press escape or the start. Okay, that's just it. That's just... Once I gotta get my... Dude, I hope I can change outfit. Alright, we're out of here. I wish it was a driving mini game where I could run over things. Yeah, I don't know what that tree demon was about. Uh, hello, officer. Step aside. This is a job for a priest. Yeah, I'm gonna need to go in. I'm not a preacher. I'm a priest. Can I get hit by a car? I probably shouldn't try it. Do it. Uh, Alright, I'll make it look like an accident. Alright, officer. Thank you for your time. I'll even do it again. Watch. Ah, so this must be the place of, uh... Wait, that, no, the timing was off. Uh, no, that was stupid. That wasn't funny. Bored. The wall says Amy? Is that what that says? Fest. Calling all metal fans, Bezel Fest 1987 rocks the hell out of Hartford. Friday night, 10 p.m. to 2 a.m. Featuring appearances by When All Is Said and Done, Trust No Corpse, The Horror Is Dead, Basement 2, Return to Bondage, Among the Bloodied, Lying Still in Silence, Mother of Shadow, and The Door to Afterbirth. God, tickets, five, $3, $5 at the door, I gotta go. This is where Amy worked. Facts. Yeah. Was... To Rhonda Erickson from Gary Miller. 
Hi Rhonda, just a couple of reminders after last week's visit. Please keep your desk tidy. Our patients need to feel at ease with their healthcare expertise experience. Remember our sales points, clean, quick, courteous. Do not return any calls from the de Department of Health before notifying me first or leaving a message with Tiffany. We cannot afford another surprise inspection. Please do call me on my direct personal line if you happen to hear back from Mr. Martin. One more thing, keep Jeffrey out of sight. Remember, Gary loves you. Shaybot, thank you for the 14 months, dude. I still am not sure who Gary is. Who is Gary? Maybe we're not supposed to know yet. Oh, look, guys, a little baby. It's a picture of a little baby. I bless you, this baby. Another little baby! This one's kind of cute. Big blessings to this baby. Oh. Um, extra blessings to this one. That one looks kind of screwed up. Hmm. <laughs> that one, yeah, that one, like, that one marinated for too long. Aha, a crowbar. This is perfect. This is exactly what I needed because there were boards over that door over there. <laughs> it sounded like so <laughs> sounded like so much effort went into him saying that come when drop duck ah, ah, let me go help someone help me he's got me <sighs> Oh, this is cool. Oh. Where am I? I need to hide. Where? Loss? Okay, I see it, I see it, you're right. Like, wouldn't he just be able to see me? From the angle he's standing at? I wanna try to... smokes. Oh wait, how am I gonna get up the stairs, man? This place is not very- oh shoot. I need to hide. Mm, 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 mm. There's no way this works. How do I- Oh brother, ah. Uh, blend in. Way ahead of you. Maybe don't move? I'll try. But that doesn't make sense.
quit in front of you, distracted. Now we move. How do I hide in here, though? I don't, um... Where? Don't move a muscle. Don't even breathe. The fool. All right, next order of business. What do I? How does a guy like me get unattached from a like a hospital bed? I'm gonna try to go up the stairs. Oh, hey, can you help me? <laughs> Thank you, we've got to run! Wait, did I forget my keys down here? I want to see if I can open this door really quick. Cop, stay close. This is demon shit. This is, a, this is my expertise. I kind of want to take the cop in there to, to like, get, let him... Get... Oh my god, look at this. He's stuck. He snagged the stupid idiot. Will he follow me? Yeah. Let's get out of this place. Hurry, cop. No, I'm gonna need my crowbar. Oh, shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! I don't know! Shoot it! Do your job! Shoot him! Oh, you didn't even- You missed, you fucking idiot! What are we supposed- uh, Now he's out there! Shoot him again! Shoot him! Quick, quick! You gotta aim better, dude. Don't you do the- What are you doing, that Fortnite dance? What are you- Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot his ass! If you can't do something your dumb self, you gotta do something yourself. Wait, what is it? I'm gonna- I'm gonna get him with my cross, just a minute. Little assistance would be great, officer, but it's fine if you don't feel like it. Thank you. That was all you. Alright, what do you say we get out of here? Damn hippies. Oh no! <laughs> Officer? Officer, are you good? I guess he's not gonna be needing this gun anymore. Oh, I guess I'm not either. It's fine, I didn't need him anyway. No, I can't pick up his gun. Unfortunately... Uboa? Huh? I'm gonna try to cross the road without getting hit. Alright, so it appears that Amy had a demon baby in her- wait, was it Amy that had the de- no, 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 not Amy. Who had the demon baby? There was a demon baby. There was a demon baby. No. <laughs> Flashback. This is Amy. 
Oh. Get the book and recite the prayer of the exorcism. Oh, my bad, father. Exorcizo te creatura, Salis. I juro it's something, something. I bless this demon. Sorry, you're, sorry, preacher. I threw it to the other side of the room. Ajorno te serpents disgust us. Exorcizo te perdeum vivum phantasma. In, in nome Jesu Christi, qui venturas es judicare vivos te mortuos. Get back up, you should not be down here. Go back upstairs, guys. Guys, with me, please. Sorry you had to see that. She's fine, she's actually coming along quite, quite well. You know, we're expecting the turnaround to be pretty quick. You should have her back to normal by the evening. Yeah, I really wish you guys didn't come down here and see me spit on her, but it's okay. It's all part of the process, actually. Why don't you have a seat at the table? Uh, yeah. Well, yeah, it's a demon inside her. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. Alright, guys, stay up here. I'm gonna go finish up down here. Surely nothing happening happened in my surely had nothing happened in my time that I was gone. Oh, these mannequins are quite moved around a bit, but it's fine. Father. Father. Wake up. So that's where I got the good cross. October 29th, 1987, two days until the profane Sabbath. I'm not going in there. Yeah, yeah, I know. Oh, lots of mail today on this fine evening of our Lord. John, for now, this is the only way I can contact you. I think they're watching me. I need you to come over as soon as you can. This situation has gotten much worse. My address is 665 <laughs> Orange Street, apartment 5A, New Haven, Connecticut, 06511. Thank you, Lisa. Please, for some reason, I don't answer the door. Get the spare key from my friend Tiffany. Yeah, I guarantee I'm going to have to go into apartment number 666. John, there's an apartment building in the New Haven where they may be attempting to summon Malfas. I'm not going to be able to go there myself. It's up to you to stop their rituals. Father Garcia, I r this seems like a pressing matter. I would really appreciate your company, but... John, I don't know if you're getting my letters or not, but I hope you'll be here soon. I really need your help. They're in the apartment. I see them all the time now. I can hear them in the darkness. I haven't slept in days. When you get here, just come straight into my place. Tiffany can't be trusted. Don't talk to my neighbors either. They won't let me leave. Lisa. Alright, time to go slay a demon. Wait, what's across the road? Anything? Nope. Oh! I can go, like, visit my neighbors. Dong, 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 dong. <laughs> I love this movie. Gong, 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 gong. Did you kill me? Why am I just watching through... That's not very good of me. I should not be watching through people's windows. Necropancer? Yeah, they're watching Wrestling Empire. Why not? You know what? Good point. I'm gonna go peek through my own window, see if I can see anything cool. Oops. Let's 
Let's go see what these people are up to. They're watching the same show. Yeah, I heard about first person mode in Wrestling Empire. I'm excited to check it out. That seems weird though, like... What would that, like, what? That doesn't seem like it'd be fun. I would rather, like, a third person camera that you can actually, like, control well. Maybe it'll be awesome though. I'll gladly check it out. It's horrible. <laughs> I just wish they would add a functional, working, like, third person camera. Ah, this must be the apartment. This must be the place. Wait a minute. That that truck. That, that this car looks familiar. Surely nothing. Live casual. Thank you. Or sorry, that's probably live casual. Thank you for the two months. Appreciate you. Apartment number 665, so that should be on the 6th floor. Hello, Mr. Ward. I am sorry to have worried you. I am perfectly fine. I have not been feeling like myself lately. However, I am much better now. Please do not trouble yourself with coming to visit. I've decided to take an extended vacation in the country, so you will not find me at my home. Sincerely, Lisa. I should kick my oh. from Lisa. You know what? She's fine. <laughs> oh, all of this was for nothing. Yeah, I guess it's time to go back home. I'm going back up. <laughs> Gonna wait until I find a flashlight or something. That was not... that was not cool. One weakness of priests is that they're deathly afraid of the dart. Let's see... Anything of interest? Yeah, for real, I'd be carrying a flashlight everywhere with me if I... If I was this priest. Gong, 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 gong! What do we got here? What is this? I should put- I, I just realized I have the tag on Faith Chapter 1, I think. <laughs> when will I learn to, like, update my shit, dude? No one's perfect. Thank you, dude. Alright. You said get her name off the little... thing in here? She said she was in 665, though. 7A, 6A, 4B, 5... Wait, what? What was this lady's name? I gotta check my notes. Lisa. We don't know her last name. Apartment 5A. <clears throat> Let's see. Apartment 5A. 5B. 5A. Lisa Pearson. Wait, you know what? Guys, I believe that's probably Pearson. 
Apartment 5A. <clears throat> Let's do it. We are. Oh, a note. If you like playing games, the first floor is a great place to start over. However, to play the game, you must know the rules. Beware. If you have a susceptible soul, you might get pulled. Oh, come on. I don't need to be reading this kind of scary crap. Boom, boom, boom. Five A must be this way. There's only two. There's only two like apartments on a floor. It's locked. Uh huh. <laughs> Guys, don't worry. My soul is not susceptible. I'm a damn priest. For crying out loud. All right, we gotta go to the first floor. Actually, let's go to six six five. One sec, beer back. Guys, uh, Plum's ordering pizza, so hallelujah, praise the Lord. I knew playing this game today was a good idea. The Lord bless me. Nose picking break, shut your mouth. Guys, you think I would tell you think I would stop telling you when I pick my nose? I've been telling you every single time now. Elevator friend. Timmy. That's uh that's cute. But who whatever who's whoever's kid drew this needs to be put down. That was actually I don't appreciate that. I I, I gotta go to floor one. It's art. Shut your mouth. All right, they said floor one's a good place to start, but there's not much of anything down here. Charborg spelled backwards as booger? Shut up! What are you talking about? Let me read my notes. Let me review the, the freaking footage, dude. If you like playing games, the first floor is a great place to start over. However, to play the game, you must know the rules. Beware, if you have a susceptible soul, you might get pulled in. I'm about to freaking die. You'll die to what? What was that? Dreary Island. Thank you for the first time prime, dude. The neighbor has a key? Yeah, but they also, you know, yeah. Let me go try. I thought her her neighbor I thought her neighbor had the key. I tried both the doors down here, didn't I? Maybe I'm maybe I'm going off of a false memory. Gong 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 gong. Hello. The weird spy. Thank you, dude, for the first time sub.
Okay. I don't know if you're getting my letters or not, but I hope you'll be here soon. I really need you to help. They're in the apartment. I see them all the time. I can hear them in the darkness. Blah, blah, blah. Come straight to my place. Tiffany can't be trusted. Don't talk to my neighbors either. They won't let me be. Okay, where does Tiffany live? I need you to come over as soon as you can. The situation's gotten worse. My address is this apartment 5A. Okay. Get the spare key from my friend Tiffany. Okay, Tiffany. Okay, we got to go downstairs and see what Tiffany's address is. One sec. We gotta look for names that start with T. T for Tiffany, that is. Okay, nothing there. T Boone. Apartment 8A. Remember that. Remember that. T Boone or T Robinson. That'd be 3B. Could be 3B. Alright. Remember th 3B and 8A. 3B 8A, 3B 8A, 3B 8A, 3B 8A. <laughs> 3B 8A. Man, this song makes me shake my little booty. 3B 8A. Oh, the door's open. And what have I found? A little pack of cig a little cigarette back here? Tiffany? Looks like she left the TV on. This must be the key. Hey Tiffany, are you back there in that blood room? Also, this looks so cool, like this look. That could be an album cover. Alright. Oh! The, uh... Teletubbies, or something, is on. Oh! I just missed it. Do I hear something? I need to check. I'm gonna check room 8A also, just in case. I just wanna see. My curiosity is peaked. Oh, wait, is that implying that I'm pushing the elevator buttons with my cross? Did you see the little cross selection menu? That's cool. I would do that definitely. Alright, let's go to 8A. Let me see if this is open or anything. Aha! A letter! Always explore your surroundings. It's important. Those who keep knocking on the forbidden doors will be visited by the one who guards them. Yeah, whatever. Alright, let's check 8A. Aha! So this also could be... Tiffany's place. Uh -uh. Our sister Tiffany has gone against the will of the unspeakable. I thought I could trust her, but I was wrong. Proceed with the original plan. The woman in 5A will be our vessel. Let her pious friend come to rescue her. The unspeakable shall crush them both. Ah, they're talking about what's her face? Amy. Wait, not Amy. What's her name? I gotta get down there. Lisa, yeah, 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 Lisa. Look. I push the I push the elevator buttons with my uh cross. Okay, um floor what floor was she on? Five. Uh 
How do we know Lisa? I think she just called a priest. Check the top floor for giggles. Yeah, you know, I kind of was thinking that while I was in the elevator. I bet there's roof access. At least this song, this song gives me happy vibes. In a world so full of madness, you'll take any little bit of happiness you can get. This place doesn't have an apartment number. Hello? Do priests come over if you call? Yeah, like, wait a second, guys, if I called... If I called, like, a priest and said that I, I had someone who was possessed, would they come over? Could I get a priest over here? That might be a stream idea. Oh, M. It's locked. Sacrifice what you cling to. I'm not giving the cross up. Thanks, thanks for the offer, but no. No thanks. <clears throat> They're like Geek Squad? <laughs> That's cool. They don't do that anymore? What if I'm really fucking got somebody who's possessed? And I need a priest ASAP. Alright, let's go check this shit out. Oh yeah. Yep. That looks bad. What do you think, God? He spoke to me and he said it looked bad too. Oh, this is good. If you wish to break the seal of Alu, your answer lies in the blood-stained knife and the face hiding in the deep dark. But only those who have ascended to the highest point can descend to the lowest depths. Remember, Gary loves you. Oh, that is that is I don't know if I'm just getting smarter with these puzzles, but that was just so on the nose. I gotta go up to the 10th floor. Gotta go up to the 10th floor. Go in there. Then go to the bottom floor. Then go back here. All right, let's go get this shit. Tenth floor. L joke. This is... Okay. <clears throat> oh, wait. They just let me in. Okay. There must be a really shallow apartment. Oh, here we go. What have we got? Basement dumbwaiter. How to use. Pull up on the handle to open the hatch. Place item or being to be sacrificed inside the... Whoa! Pull down the handle to close the hatch. Press the button to send Dumbwaiter to the basement. Light will blink red if done successfully. Please make sure your sacrifice does not jostle around inside the container. Do not open hatch once Dumbwaiter has reached the basement. I do not have enough earplugs and I am tired of people losing them. Please wait for the green light to come on before using. I didn't retain any of that. Oh, this is a little, like, security camera. 
Let's see what we're dealing with. Let's throw the, throw the cross in. You've done me well. Thank you for your time. And now we... Oh, look, there it is. Look, look, look. We got visual. We got visual. Okay, he's down there. Wait, I gotta review the notes. Wait. Hold down the handle, close the hatch, press the button to send the dumbwaiter down the basement. Light will blink red if done successfully. Please make sure your sacrifice does not jostle around inside. Do not open the hatch once the dumbwaiter has reached the basement. Wait, don't open the hatch? What happens if I open it? Okay, never mind. Go to the basement? It says wait for the green light, though. Maybe I just go to the basement. Were these candles where it's always here? Were these guys doing the freaking YMCA always here? I feel like things have, like, changed a little. Was this music was always pitched downward? Odd, I said floor one. Hello? <laughs> Huh. Gary lied to us when you see it run. Wait. Uh. Oh my god, am I gonna have to use a camera down in the basement to light up the dark? Oh, brother. Oh, brother. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, have I been in here? Wait, that room's open! And there's more demonic writing on the ground. Oh, I know, it's gone, it's gone. There could be something really good, or something really bad in here. And I'll be willing to take my chances. Oh! Okay, there's a freaking, like, witch doctor or something. Where that freaking hell? Oh my god, I'm having a flashback to. Spookinator, thank you. For the hundred bits. What a startle. I'm just gonna try to get back into the elevator and. Bad news, guys. We're gonna have to take the long way down. Don't say oh, Meggy lol, I hate that. <laughs> Why do you hate it? I don't know, it's weird. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, Maggie lol. It's like, I don't know, I don't know.
I want to go back in here and see if I can see what was in that room. Surely that witch... Oh, I gotta move my mouse. Sorry for the immersion breaking, guys. Okay, here we go. Is this a secret tunnel way? I should not be in here. Okay, let me see let me see where it saved me. Maybe don't flash them? Oh, that's a good call. You know what? That's a good call. If I don't turn the camera on, how will they know? They're just standing in the pitch black. Okay, that was a lot of blood. Wait. I'm going to combine two strategies. Let me get a good look at this place really quick. Yeah, guys, there might just be a rift to hell in the living room of this house. Not good. That's not good. I have one of those two it's from Mildew. Oh. I think they should tell their landlord about that so they'll come fix it. So they'll so they'll put it off for months and not do anything about it and then make not give you your deposit back whenever <laughs> whenever you move out. Yeah, I think you should probably <laughs> Pick it up. Don't just stand. Pick it up. That's not a real image. Wait, what is this? What was that, a dagger? A sacrificial dagger? Die. I would pick it up, but it won't let me. All right, I'm gonna keep going down. Wait, no, this is as far down as I can go. Uh, wait. I got- Oh, fuck! I think I see something under the table over here. Yes, there's stairs going down. Yeah, sorry about the sorry about the high pitch, guys. Oh my god, did you see that? Maybe my imagination? Taking another picture? Definitely not my imagination. There's something approaching. Even closer than before, guys? Uh can't get a good read on what it is. It looks humanoid. <laughs> This isn't too bad. Oh, yikes! Okay. <laughs> Does it say butter? Mustard? <laughs> you think it sounds like mustard? Wait, let's listen again. If it happens. Mustard!
All right, we're approaching the basement. Why am I bleeding out my ass? Did you see that? <laughs> Maybe not. I don't know. Chipotle? Whoa, baby, whoa! Oh, there's my cross. Wait. When I saw the camera, there was a guy down here. I'm getting my cross back. I'm not scared of anything when the Lord's in my hand. Oof. We're back. Wait, what's that terrible noise? You! What does this- what does this mean? It looks like the Twitch smiley mode. Ew! Wait, was I just trying to, like, absolve someone's, like, cut off face? This does not look at all- look, that looks like a cute little smile. This looks grody. Alright, I'm gonna go read this letter. My beloved Gary, alas, the mask is already stained with blood. My blood. The ritual is complete. You will not find me on this mortal plane, for I am beyond. Look for me in the unseen world, if you dare. Tiffany. Wait! My Tiffany? I've really gotta work the devil out of this one. Come on! Come on, Tim! Come on, damn it! This isn't working. Maybe if I rub the cross on it long enough. Is this an Easter egg, do you think, or no? Maybe there's a glitch. I'm gonna go leave the room and come back. Spit on it? <laughs> yeah, guys, I don't know. I don't think this... I don't... Something's weird. Yeah, that was the holiest spit I could muster. Something... Something odd. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. I, I don't want to be here any longer. on? <laughs> Your sugar addiction is showing. Yeah, me when I haven't had sugar in a, in a freaking hour and a half. I start getting all fucked up. Let me try to put this face on. All right, back upstairs we go. The wall? What wall? Wait, oh, was there more blood riding on the wall? Not seven. Is 
70 times 7. 70 times 7. Not 7. Wait. Not 7. 70 times 7. 420? Guys, that's nonsense to me. I don't know what that means. Matthew 18, 20... How, shut up! I, this is not... <laughs> I'm getting out of this hellhole. Dude, the walk. Wait, isn't there a slower one of the walk? We have the walk and then we have the fast walk. Is there a slower one? Guess not. The trudge. <laughs>Keep going up. I'm gonna go one by one and see what we've missed. Oh. Wait. Okay. Get the knife? Oh yeah, there was that sacrificial knife. Okay, this is where that shit was. Now maybe I can get a moment to read what all this is trying to tell me. Wait, what happens in 10 days? Nice cursor. Oh, sorry. Sorry, guys. How unprofessional. Bible 2 comes out. Oh my god, wait, the Bible 2 is coming out? Huh. Oh god, that's cool. Wow, what a historic moment. Every initiated follower knows that in order to bring about the second death, one must sacrifice seven by passing them through the carved out and pure vessel's face. Then shall the unspeakable war be with the second death, such as the fate of that whore Amy. My beloved Gary has set his sights far too low. I will surpass her. Wait, no, it says seven. It's not seven, it's 77. Oh my god, guys. They took the power of my cross. This thing does not have God in it anymore. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Now this is just like a, a the letter T. This is bad. Let's go back to the 10th floor and see if that green light is on. They uninstalled God. I soft locked it? Wait, really? Yeah, I might have to reset. Oh, it's 100% bugged. Dang it.
Oh. Why? How do I like continue? Wait, Marathon is no save? You chose Marathon, that's got no saves. All three chapters in one session. Why? I thought that meant just like you play it like back to back to back. Guys, I don't know what to say. I'm not doing that again. I don't have time tonight. It's too late. What is this? Show needles? Why is there a non-savable mode? <laughs> oh, that's awful. What the fuck? I thought, I don't know, I just misunderstood. I thought that meant that it was like... The option to pick when you wanted to play all three of them. <laughs> Sag Mortis. <laughs> all right, well, I guess that's all for tonight. That fucking sucks. I don't have time to redo all that. All right, guys. I'll probably just, I don't know. Lesson learned? <laughs> What a weird lesson that was, though. Why did I have to learn that lesson? That's just weird. What kind of mode is this? Why would you want to do that? I don't know. Like, why does that- why would I assume that that's what that meant? I thought it was like- I don't know. Alright, anyway. I'm done for the night. Unfortunately...